dear students today we are going to see in multiplication lesson exercise 4.4 okay in exercise 4.4 today's our topic is word problem okay so look here our first word problem is maria travels 125 km in one day how many kilometers will she travel in five days okay so uh, in word problem already you know sentence is needed okay sentence is must so our first sentence is coming in word problem is maria travels 125 km in one day so here first sentence is coming number of kilometers travels in one day so how many okay in one day 125 kilometers travels so here we write 125 okay now the second sentence is coming how many kilometers will she travel in 5 days okay so she travels number of days he uh, we write show number of days that she travel five okay which answer is coming five understood so here we give the sign of multiplication and we solve okay in your notebook you make here proper column okay this is ones tens hundred and what we find out here we find out how many kilometers will she travel in five days okay number of days and we find out she travels in 5 days kilometer okay we find out now we solve it 5 finds up how many okay 5 five is at 25 so we write here 5 in ones place and 2 is carried over on tens place understood now come to the tens column 5 to the 10 we add here to 10 plus 2 12 Here we write two. One is carry. Okay. Now come to the hundreds column. Five and the five. And here we add one. Five plus one six. Okay. Means our answer is coming. She travels six hundred twenty-five kilometers in five days. So our line is coming. Last line is very important. Thus, only in uh, how many places you write our answer. Okay. The six hundred twenty-five kilometer will she travel in five days. Understand? Okay. Now our next problem from your exercise four point four. Okay. I take this example. See you. Our second problem is there are two hundred seventy three chocolates in a packet. Okay, how many chocolates will be there in a eight such packets? In one packet, how many chocolates are there? Two hundred seventy three, and we find out in eight packets how many chocolates are there. Okay, here is a no space. That's why uh, I saw here upside. Okay, see you. Our second problem. Our first sentence is coming. Number of number of chocolates in a packet. Okay. Number of chocolates in a packet. How many? Two hundred seventy-three. So we write here two hundred seventy-three. Now our second sentence is coming. Number of packets. Number of packets. How many number of packets? Eight. So we write here eight. Okay. And what we find out? How many chocolates will be there in eight such packets? Okay. We find out. Number of chocolates 
in a packets okay we find out here now we solve this problem okay we arrange here in proper column this is ones place tens place hundred place okay and now we solve here now see 273 multiplied by 8 now 8 3 is a okay 8 3 is a 24 so we write here 4 in ones place and 2 is carry over on tens place understood now next come to the tens column 8 7 is a 8 7 is a 56 we add here 2 56 uh, 56 plus 2 58 so we write here 8 and 5 is carry over on hundreds column okay now next from the hundreds column 8 to the 16 16 plus 5 is 21 so we write here 21 means our answer is coming 2184 thus our final line is coming thus 2184 chocolates will be there in such eight packets. Understood? Okay. In this page, you solve exercise 4.4 .4 in your maths notebook. Okay? Thank you so much. Bye-bye.